New details tonight around 70 people are without a home after a massive fire tears through an apartment complex in DeKalb. Chopper 46 capturing the inferno at the Alderwood Trail on North DeKalb Drive in Doraville. And tonight CBS 46's Barmel Lyons joins us live from the complex and Barmel, a lot of people who live there are hurting tonight. Yes, that's right, Rick. A lot of people hurting tonight. Now you can actually still smell that smoke in the air. DeKalb County Fire Rescue just leaving the premises. And we see a lot of people just outside trying to figure out what's going to happen next. A Red Cross of Georgia has been out here trying to assist as well. Look, this is the cut that I got. Resident Alex is Roblero, scraped and bruised after he rushed out the burning building. It isn't really too bad, but it still kind of hurts. So I tried all I could, but it had been too late. The fire was already engulfing the apartments. Heavy smoke and flames filling the breezeway. Addict and all three floors after Alderwood Trail Apartments on North DeKalb Drive. Residents using ladders to help get people out. 12 units, 12 families now out of a home. Our biggest concern was just making sure that everybody was out. So once we got here, even though we saw people getting rescued, we went in and made sure that everybody was out. You no, know, I felt sad for my mother-in-law. She was crying. Asbury Bernal says she's grateful her family got out in time. Oh, they came out with that was shoes. That they couldn't get anything. Resident Chanel Ventura says she prays that she, along with other families, will be able to get back some of their memories. Do you have family to stay with? Uh, yes. I'm actually at uh, um, my uncle's house right now. Now American Red Cross is helping with some of those people who need a place to stay, providing lodging as well as anything in regards to medication and food that will be needed. That fire not only being damaging to that building, but also water damage, according to DeKalb County Fire Department. That fire and how it started is still under investigation. In DeKalb, I'm Barma Lyons, CBS 46 News.